There was some weird science going on at a Rockford Middle School tonight. The spooky lessons were crafted around the Halloween theme. One Flynn teacher tells Dylan Sorocki the hope is if students have fun with science today, they'll come to class eager to learn more tomorrow. Dylan. Yeah, Eric and Hannah, educators are optimistic that kids and parents alike are walking away impressed by the science of Halloween. Halloween's magical, right? And science is magic that works. <laughs> and, you know, and all magic is pretty much science, so it works out really well. Rockford families are treated to some spooky science Monday night at Flynn Middle School. Educators led experiments involving puking pumpkins, candy corn towers, and dry ice potions. <laughs> Teacher Colleen Ford even dressed as an undead scientist to demonstrate different chemical reactions. It's always fun to do something fun with science that's not necessarily related to our curriculum, but kind of shows off how cool science can really be as students learn more and more about it. Administrators say the community event was designed so parents could take a more active role in their child's education. Flynn hopes to hold different events for other subjects later on this year. It's really important to, um, to form a connection with them and have them come in and be a part of our school and see what their kids are doing. Assistant Principal Brandy Fago says taking learning outside of the typical school day can be beneficial for kids, too. Some people think education's not fun, but, you know, there's a ton of stuff that's fun about education. Like, in science every day, they're doing experiments and, you know, learning new things. We just had a chemical reaction. If they get excited tonight about science, maybe they'll come into their science class tomorrow and be a little bit more excited or interested and engaged to learn what's going on in there. And hopefully we can use that to carry throughout the year. Bago says a math night is currently being planned for November. Teachers will lead families in different games involving math and problem solving. Eric, Hannah.